<clears throat> hey, what's up, guys? It's Silver One, and this has been a topic I've kind of wanted to talk about for a while. Um, in a bit, video I saw today, just kind of pushed me to uh, just get on with it and talk about it. Um, so it's about morals and uh, graffiti, and I don't really want to hate on this kid anymore than I already have, because I kind of got pissed off at him, and uh, a lot of people are giving him hate, so he doesn't really deserve much more hate, even though the guy. It's kind of an asshole because in the video um, he tags people's trucks and their garage doors and he lives, it looks like, like in a suburb, in like a neighborhood establishment. He just goes up and tags 1000 for his 1K video or whatever on someone's door, um, on someone's garage door. He tagged trucks, like homes and shit. Like, and that just wanted me to talk about like that's way out of line. Um, and even though, like, a lot of people think of graffiti as all vandalism, or that's the kind of things giving graffiti a bad name, like, in my opinion, uh, some people may not share these same opinions, but there's certain, uh, there's a pretty base, pretty universal code that's understood by all writers, um, on morals, um, basically, you don't tag on homes, uh, you don't tag on vehicles, like, people's personal vehicles, unless it's, like, a bus or a train, obviously. Um, you don't tag, you'd want to try not to tag on personal property. If it's like an alley or something like that, go ahead. But like, you don't want to bomb someone's like house. Um, or they're like, they're, yeah, you don't want to bomb people's personal property most of the time. Uh, you want to try to stick to government buildings and stuff like that. I'm not telling you to like, go bomb like capital buildings or anything like that. But you know, stuff that's owned by the state that people aren't going to have to take their hard earned money out and pay for because the people who are buffering it are getting paid to buff it. So I really don't want to say that this, but in a sense, you're kind of providing them with a job. I know that's not really right, but that, I guess you could look at it that way. But basically, in this video, it just kind of pissed me off because it's kind of like the difference between tag bangers and actual artists. And I, there definitely needs to be a uh, division between the two because they're different. Um, in my eyes, the point of graffiti is to get your art up there and get fame because that's what that's what all graffiti is about is getting fame because you want to get your name out there. You want to be known in the secret kind of way and tagging people's homes will get you known for about like maybe a week and then you're going to get arrested and you get a shit ton of community service because if there's anything I know, this kid is getting caught. One, he showed his video like 10 times in the video like and if you tag someone's house, do you really think they're not going to go to the police and find out who did it? Like, that's, like, pretty obvious. And if somebody tags your truck and you go on a little, like, spree through your neighborhood in the suburbs, like, you're definitely going to get caught. That one, Actually, yeah, that leads me to another thing. Like, don't tag your school. Um, <laughs> never, really. That's never really a good idea because you're going to get caught, uh, at least in my school. And a lot of people, have, they have cameras all throughout the school. And so many people I have heard told me that they've tagged their school. They're like, oh, yeah, I got caught tagging my school. It's like, well, don't tag your school. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to rant about that. I'll link the guy's video in the description. I've been showing you, like, bits of it here. Uh, he hasn't taken it down, which is surprising and ballsy, I guess. But in, in my opinion, don't go on there and, like, hate him. And like be like, oh, he sent me because I. It's not like this one person who's just doing it, even though he's a douchebag for doing it. Because um, you got to think about people's hard-earned money. Like, if somebody tagged like my truck or my garage door, I'd be pretty pissed. Um, but there's other people doing this, so I just kind of this just kind of brought it to my attention. And uh, so don't don't go to the video and hate on it, but just be aware. And uh, I want you guys in the comments to tell me like, what are your morals? As a writer, like, where, what will you do and, like, not do? Because uh, different people have different ethical beliefs, and I just want to get a conversation going between you guys. All right, but uh, this has been Silver One. Thanks for watching and listening. Uh, peace.